all-knowing and all-powerful, starting with the elderly wolf uncle chapter 50. And at this moment, a party is also taking place on the western campus of Metropolitan University, gradually subsiding into the horizon as the sun sets over the sky. The restaurants on the west campus are shrouded in lights. The arrival of the black curtain also makes the lights appear more dazzling. Chen, in fact, I am not very used to such occasions, as I said before, I am not suitable for this world. On the road, Chen Tian and Clark walked in the direction of the west campus at the school gate. Clark on the side looked at the crowded students, all with smiles on their faces, and felt that this scene was very lively. But this also made him, who was in it, feel out of place and uncomfortable. Clark, you have to make a change, you need to remember at all times that you are not a freak, you are smarter and stronger than anyone else. Chen Tian was a little speechless in his heart, it seemed that the great super character of this period was really far from what he imagined. It's completely a big boy with a restrained and shy personality, even some social fears, you know. Clark's eyes darkened a little, and he looked at the faces of various people passing by. Although Chen Tian's appearance began to relieve his suppressed heart. But years of habit still make Clark think that these people passing by will rush up in the next second, point at their noses and angrily call, freaks. Okay, take your time, many changes can't be achieved overnight, as long as you can have a heart to start changing, it's a good thing. After Chen Tian possessed the psychic ability, he found that even if he did not activate the ability, he could begin to detect other people's mood swings. Sensing Clark's mood change, he did not forcibly launch a verbal offensive and repeatedly stressed the importance of change. It's a relaxed choice to understand and appease. Thank you. Clark once again cast a grateful look at his new friend, but he also relaxed a lot. Chen Tian smiled. He felt he was slowly becoming a master of psychology. Then, a figure from behind came up and patted them on the back. Hey, it's a coincidence, if you can come to this party, then I can guarantee that you will not be disappointed. Quote. It was Bob who passionately hooked up on the shoulders of the two. Bob, are they your friends? Bob's accompanying female companion glanced at Chen Tian and Clark, and seemed to be quite satisfied with them. Erica, they're newcomers, don't beat him up. Bob sensed the emotions under the girl's eyes and reminded a little wordlessly. Chen Tian was not disgusted by the enthusiastic senior, and even found it somewhat interesting. Perhaps his first experience of college life in the United States, he discovered that the people in this country are indeed quite open. Just bitter Clark. It was indeed the first time he faced such a battle, and he was laughing awkwardly the whole time, and he couldn't answer at a loss. Finally, he was relieved when he arrived at the restaurant. The people from the student union have changed this place into a temporary venue, don't look at the restaurant, in fact, this place is really not bad at all. Bob walked in the front and habitually introduced the two. Between words, several people had already entered the restaurant, and the moment they opened the door, endless light shone out, and the brilliant lights on the ceiling shone brightly. Music with strong drums churned in the room, and countless well-dressed men and women soaked in it, their bodies swaying rhythmically. This place is simply perfect. The corners of Bob's mouth rose and he couldn't help but sigh. This event is held every year, but the elderly can also participate. Chen Tian found that many people with mature faces could be judged from their words and deeds to be old students. Obviously, there will be many old students tonight. The spacious restaurant that used to be visited during the day is now filled with people. Clark, don't be so restrained. Chen Tian noticed the tall Clark beside him, his expression was a little restrained to him, and the light on his face obviously made him a little uncomfortable. I'm just not used to it. Clark took a deep breath, wiped the sweat from his forehead and said. Don't be nervous, there will be many links in a while. Bob spoke. At this time, the people around cheered, and I saw that on the temporary stage in the center of the hall, tonight's host finally appeared, walked to the center and beckoned to everyone below. Countless people cheered loudly in a warm atmosphere. Later, before the party is over, everyone will vote for the best king and queen on the field. That's the old part of the years, and I think it's interesting. Bob on the side seemed to be unable to stop. Still patiently explained to Chen Tian and the two, and the most important link before the end later. Clark, I think you're going to have to find a female companion. Chen Tian lowered his head and teased. Actually, I'm not very good at dancing. Clark shrugged a little helplessly, and his eyes unconsciously searched for Lana's figure in the crowd. Soon he found the familiar silhouette. Lana, who had been facing away from him, seemed to sense the hot gaze and couldn't help but turn her head to glance at it. When it was Clark who found out, he smiled at the latter. Just then Clark received a warning from Whitney next to him, and the guy seemed to have forgotten the morning's events, and his eyes wanted to smash Clark's corpse into pieces. You'd better teach Whitney a little lesson, this guy doesn't seem to have grown a little bit zero Chen Tian also noticed this scene, turned around and said, forget it, I don't want Lana to be sad. Quote, Clark said quietly, he doesn't think of himself as a good person, or as a great saint. I just think that he shouldn't ruin other people's feelings at will. Chen Tian looked at the big boy in front of him with some helplessness, and knew without thinking that the other party might have misunderstood, not to let him rob people. Just let him teach Whitney a lesson. But, it seems normal for Clark to think so. Just thinking. Chen Tian's expression froze suddenly, and then he frowned, as if he felt a trace of abnormality, that is, after obtaining the professor's psychic ability. He could smell some unusual atmosphere before the danger was brought in. Now, however, that feeling is getting stronger. The sense of crisis is getting stronger. That's a strong reaction that comes from the head. But, what dangers would it be? It's Metropolitan University, and there's a party going on. Every corner that Chen Tian's gaze could reach, at the same time, he also released spiritual fluctuations, like a huge net intertwined to cover the vicinity, detecting the minds of everyone nearby. For him, 
Anyone with evil thoughts will be perceived. That's not right. It seems like someone is approaching. Clark, who was standing next to him, also noticed something strange and squinted slightly to look around. Then everything in front of him began to change, and through the bodies of the people around him, he directly saw through everything in the entire hall. All the sights fell into his eyes. There is no in the hall. Then only outside. Clark's eyes narrowed slightly, the obstacles in front of him became more transparent, and the scene in front of him became outside the restaurant. Moment. He saw a suspicious target, and there was a figure standing outside the gate. The figure looks extremely thin, but it gives people a strange feeling. Combat detected. Get supervision. Superman. Sighed. Chen Tian's mind also sounded the voice of receiving a reward, and after hearing it, he knew that Clark had also discovered the abnormality. And it is possible that the enemy has already been found. Chapter 1 Previous Chapter 5186 Next Chapter Next Chapter Table of Contents